I think they should lock his ass up. That's what I think. But let's talk about it. Look. So this truck driver, and ah, I gotta call. He's got a, this, He's a steering wheel holder. That's why he got. I gotta call him a steering wheel holder. And you see people like this all the time. This guy driving down I ninety four. Not sure what direction he was going, but he's driving down I ninety four. He stops his truck. This tanker right here. He stops it in the right lane. Just stops. They don't even know why he stopped, but he just stopped in the right lane. He didn't stop on the shoulder. It was two lanes. He stopped in the right lane. There's a Peterbilt coming, and the Peterbilt tried to swerve to the left lane to avoid hitting him, but he still hit him. What happened was it caused a fire, and the person in the Peterbilt, they were unalived. They didn't, they were unalived. And they are charging the guy who stopped in the right lane for it. Lock his ass up, in my opinion. I could be wrong. I don't know if he was experiencing any medical situation, so. I don't know that extent. They're not saying nothing like that. But if he just stopped in the right lane because he wanted to go in the back and, you know, um, grab a sushi roll, I don't know. <laughs> I, I don't know. You know, I, I don't know. If he wanted to go grab something, you know, and if you're wondering why he would have went to the back and got a sushi roll. <laughs> but, you know. It's just a, a sad situation. You know, do you guys think that he should be locked up? Also, he was driving a tanker and the tanker, you know, was filled with uh, ethylene glycol. And, you know, that kind of, I think, drained down the hill as well, which sucks because so many different things have been kind of like going into the water system. And it's like, you know, that's a little concerning because we bathe with the water and drink the water. It's a lot of things and train derailments. I don't know. <laughs> but let me know what y'all think. Do you guys think this guy should be locked up or what should be his sentence? He is facing negligent homicide. And I don't know how much time you get with that, but lock his ass up. All right. <laughs> Peace. <laughs>